For our upper body exercises, we're starting off with an elevated push-up. So I am on a bench here, but you could use something like your kitchen counter, a table, anything that will keep you elevated. When you're doing this exercise, the farther apart your hands are, the easier it will be. Our second exercise is also going to involve this bench, but you can do it on the floor, which is shown later, but these are tricep dips. Make sure that your elbows are close to your body and tucked in. So you don't want flared elbows or little chicken wings. You want your elbows close to your body. The farther your legs are out, the harder the exercise is. So you can mess with how close your feet are. And then this is the other version. If you don't want to mess with the bench, then you can do your tricep dips on the floor. Third exercise are arm circles. You're gonna go forwards directions and then backward direction. After a while, these will burn your shoulders, but pretty simple, just make sure your arms are straight and up higher. Very similar are our arm pulses. So instead of going in circles, you're going to go up and down with your arms. First, you'll go with your palms down and then eventually you'll switch and go with your palms up. Moving on, we have inchworms. So you're gonna walk your hands up and then back down. Make sure your core is nice and engaged here. This is very similar with our plank form. So when you get down to the bottom of it, you are in a plank, your core is engaged, and then you're just gonna walk your hands right back up. Our last exercise are shoulder taps. When you're doing these, you want to try and keep your torso as straight as possible. So when you tap from one shoulder to the next, you are trying to keep your core very tight so you're not moving side to side a bunch. And this is a front view versus the side view.